What's your reaction to find today? Or I said, oh, well, let's play Final Fantasy X. And, uh, I got to the Crusaders here. So, um, honestly, while we're talking on the, this, uh, talk over them, um, because, uh, the reason why I haven't uploaded that much is because, um, you know, I've been, you know, busy with other things. I've been, uh, you know, trying to get live stream to work and stuff like that. Honestly, this is going to be the next episode of Final Fantasy X. Um, but I got injured, I had COVID. Yeah, pretty much all that's, like, a lot to go into. I know it's a lot to swallow. Um, but still, don't want to get this done. Um, I'm going to try to put out videos regularly. Um, again, I hope this has been kind of a mess lately, so... Yeah, I just haven't really got a chance to, uh, you know, actually, like, sit down after record and actually record a proper video. Um, so, basically what I'm going to be doing is, you now just, like, uh, getting stuff done. And, um, I'm going to try to keep, uh, my upload schedule consistent, um, throughout the entirety of, you know, what I'm doing. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um... These guys are talking for a while, honestly. I can seriously just, like, sit and talk uh, here all day long. But, honestly, we got, we got uh, naturally better things to do when I listen to these two talk all day long. Um, I just want to check to see where we are for, uh, part five. Okay, good. Let me make sure. Alright. So, now we can actually leave the, uh, go ahead and leave the, uh, Kusira HUD. Uh, I guess some other stuff that we can do here in BC the village. I uh, got this house right here. We got a uh, shopkeeper. No vice minds, why not? I mean, he is, um, yeah, he can buy some stuff. I'm gonna actually you know, sell a couple things. Um, uh, grenades, high potions. Um, yeah, we, we really don't need anything on second thought. And um, yeah, I got in the chest in the last episode. Um, <laughs> you guys are wondering, uh, we will not be able to come back here. Um, yeah, nothing in this hat. Uh, let's see here. Uh, yep, we're gonna need a, yep, this is Walker's hut. Um, yeah, I just wanna go to the, the temple seminar. Um, one second here, guys. Hey, there we go. Um, we're gonna get a random test message. I'm not sure why, though. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna go, uh, present, our, uh, present ourselves to the telephone owner. And this one, the main game is gonna continue onwards. Oh, so quiet right here, because it cuts in. <coughs> yeah, come back to you guys, that's what I'm Alright guys, so, um, honestly, I was just, um, I was just checking out the footage. Uh, yeah, this is Future Me, here talking. Um, if you guys hear some, um, some anime in the background, I actually recorded this, um, and I was watching Blue Earth Assist. Uh, so if you guys hear that in the background, just, um, you know, realize that, um, no. Somehow my microphone picked up, uh, the show I was watching Blue Earth Assist. Um, yeah, it's just like checking over the clip and, uh, yeah, so I'm just going to sit here and talk to you guys, um, also I would record, I would re-record this, uh, but, you should all be able to double check and, uh, make sure that I'm not, you know, <laughs> recording anything, um, on, on, other than the other game, because, uh, yeah, that was, uh, kind of a, kind of a dick move on my end. But yeah, we are going to be doing something in this uh, video, which I'm not really too... <laughs> yeah, I'm just afraid of your thing. Yeah, so um... <coughs> Yeah, I, uh, am probably going to, um, hopefully run through it best I can. 
Because, uh, yeah, one thing about this uh, game is that um, it is uh, it is things kind of repetitively, and honestly, it is kind of a pain in the ass to do on these each time um, you come uh, to a new temple. I had to take some water because I'm um, also something hunting. My voice is gonna you know, get uh, raspy, and honestly, I want to keep my voice up as I'm recording this because honestly, um, if you don't know something about me, I actually post commentate because, like, if I'm recording stuff like that, yeah, uh, cutscene here. Let's let check over this cutscene. <coughs> uh, let's see what happens here. Yeah, take a rest. Why not? Alright guys, so, um, had to make a little bit of an edit there. Um, yeah, I don't like I'm doing like multiple things here. Um, yeah, so basically, I have to, uh, essentially, because I just took out the whole clip, um, like, the whole thing. Um, yeah, I had to, uh, basically turn, um, the entire clip volume down, so... Yeah, don't hear anything in the background, because honestly, first of all, one, if I do that, yeah, <laughs> I just want to turn all of it down, just so it is, you know, silent, and honestly, I don't record anything else, it's silent anyways. Um, so yeah, nothing too crazy, but we got a flashback here to, uh, to well, honestly, she's pretty, very pretty. Yeah, pretty much, um, Titus has a grudge against his father. Um, uh, you guys not already knew that from the original. I uh, hope you guys are actually, uh, playing along, um, at home. If you guys have this game, definitely recommend following this Let's Play. Um, you guys should probably just follow this Let's Play anyways. Alright, so Waka is completely gone, and I have a good idea of where he is. Because you guys saw that uh, priestess actually came into actually came into Walker's hut, and um, yeah, pretty much we are going to go ahead and go find Waka. So yeah, here we go. All right, here we go. Yep. Yeah, Cloister of Trials, which is uh, and eh, not my favorite thing to do in the game. Definitely one of my least favorite things to do within this game is the Cloister of Trials. Some of them are hard, some of them are easy. I'm not gonna lie, I hate the Cloister Trials. Pretty much it is one of the things that I do not like doing in this game, but since I've done mostly all of them, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna walk you guys through it. Yeah, like I care. <laughs> on that line. Yeah, maybe one's such a good idea after all. Alright, so yep, Cloister Trials. This is the Cloister Trials. Um, yep, Cloister Trials. Uh, yep, find a way. Um, uh, we, uh, went to the of the Faith. Uh, examine, and, uh, press X. Um, to open the way. Yep. Pretty much the Cloister Trials is just like a trial set by Yevon. Yep, a strange glyph goes on the wall. That's that. Yep. And we're heading in uh, now. All we're going to do is we're going to walk over 
Excuse me, sorry, wait, yeah. Gonna slight lag here. I'm gonna test the glyph. Now, the fastest way to basically the main set of the, um, of the, uh, this, uh, cloister, uh, this cloister here. So, yep, uh, you must, yep. Yep, so, glyph sphere, um, also the way to continue with the faith. Um, the treasure sphere, also the way to hidden treasure, and, uh, the Poseidon sphere. I'm gonna try to explain what all I need to do here. Yep, so, I'm gonna take this, um, I'm gonna take this sphere here. Yeah, you can only carry one sphere at a time. And what we're gonna do is put the sphere in this door here. Then we wanna do is take the sphere again. And then we're gonna put the sphere in here, which is gonna open up the way to the chamber of the faith. Uh, no, that's not actually opens the way to the Tristan Sphere. This actually opens the way to the Chamber of the Faith. Yeah, so that's what I mean. So where I'm running right now is that's where my hidden treasure is. Um, I'm going to touch the glyph here, the thing, and it's going to open this up. So there we go. Now this is going to be the Poseid Sphere, yep. And I'll put the Poseid Sphere in here. It's going to open the way. Now I'll say do not, um, yeah, I'm in the pedestal, yep, I did the shine glyph. Um, now do not push this directly just yet, because obviously, first of all, one, we're going to need the destruction sphere, which is right here, we're going to take the sphere. And we're going to bring it all the way back to here. Put this right into here. And what I'm going to do is open up the, uh, that. And as you can see, we get our treasure from the, uh, Cloister Trials. So, um, the one thing that you want to do is make sure that you go around to every Cloister Trials and actually get the Rod of Wisdom from this one. Yep, um, yeah, obtain the, um, special items by using the, uh, Detection Sphere. Um, so now, what you can do is actually go ahead and push this all the way to the Shining Glyph on the floor, and we are done. But the uh, first cluster of trials. Now the only thing is, um, you want to make sure that you get every single treasure from the cluster of trials, because otherwise, um, because honestly, it does reward you with a uh, powerful. Um, I can't remember what called. I think. Oh, what's it called? Aeon, I think it's called? Yeah, um, so every summoner gets an Aeon. Um, and, you know, and then our new character, our summoner, is gonna get one of the more powerful Aeons in the game. Um, if you pick up every, every single treasure. So, yeah, it's kind of a, kind of a thing that you want to do to get, you know, every single, every single treasure you can. Because let me tell you, it is worth the, uh, definitely worth the trouble. Definitely worth the trouble to actually get every single treasure. Because, uh, let me tell you, some treasures are, you know, yeah. <laughs> um, so, right there is Kamari, and to be a black mage, Lulu. Um, yeah, her name is actually named, her name is actually Lulu. Yeah, so basically she is going to be our black mage at the game. And she's also a very weak black mage right now. 
but Ozzy will be able to um, get her new spells and actually will learn how to use her. Um, uh, maybe in this episode, maybe in the next episode. Um, you now I gotta just learn how like um, party system works and stuff like that, turns and whatnot. And also, I'll be sure to make sure I don't touch the audio before um, I actually start recording. Um, but yeah, I'm currently injured right now. Like, I have a thing on my back, so. Yeah, I'm just like, um, you know, trying to move carefully here. And there we go. There's our summoner. And I tell ya, she is cute. Um, that is Summoner Yuna. Um, Lord Braska's daughter. Yeah, no, the geezer. <laughs> um, but we are done in the temple pretty much. Um, so yeah, honestly, we don't need to be here anymore, so we can just, like, you know, head outside. And Waka is actually telling us to go over here. And yeah, we got a cutscene here, and I'm <laughs> grabbed by the neck. Can't see, yeah, of course, can't see anything, because... Hey, you guys are playing on at home, you got to this point. You should be able to hear the music that's playing, it's actually the, uh, the, uh, main, uh, main theme on the, uh, menu. And there we go, there's our first Aeon. Val 4. <sighs> yeah, this is our first Aeon Val 4. I'll spend that name off while you know, we'll get to name him. <sighs> yeah, so that is our first Aeon, as you guys see here. He has a default name called Valifor. Um, we could name him, but... Eh, I kind of want to just, like, you know, stick with the, uh, yep, the name here. Just, I'm gonna go with, uh, Valifor. Yeah, so honestly, this is going to be our um, team for Blitz as well. To do our best. <laughs> Yeah, victory. <laughs> oh, man. I gotta say. 
I'm feeling meaner. Why not? Nope. Um. Yeah, Lady Yuna. That's her sort of name, Yuna. Yeah, I saw the, uh, Aeon. Yeah, so... Yeah, so honestly, Walker asked us about, you know, um, right about, yeah, now. Good, eh? Yes, he is. Okay, <laughs> no idea. No fun. There we go. Yep, of course. Yeah, I guess, I gotta be honest. He is cute. Definitely cute. Definitely 110% cute. Yeah, he doesn't even have a dog part in the background. Hang on, let me go ahead and mute myself. Alright, so let me myself there. And, uh, yeah, we are in Times of Dreams, so, uh, yeah, I'll pick this up next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy X. Have a great rest of the day. Peace. <laughs>